Ritu, many thanks for joining us. News from the aviation space. India has jumped to the number 48 spot as per the audit conducted by the United Nations International Civil Aviation Organization. That's not all. SpiceJet has announced that its operations and safety processes have been found to be in order by the ICAO. Danish is standing by. We more Danish. Well, the Indian aviation sector is reaching new skies as India has achieved the number 48 ranking as per the recently conducted audit by ICAO, which is a UN body. Well, uh, this audit was conducted after a very long time and over the past two, three years, we have seen drastic changes in various parameters and hence, we have seen a huge jump for India when it comes to these ICAO rankings. As per its normal protocol, the ICAO conducted its audit on SpiceJet and SpiceJet was judged on various different parameters which included flight operations, maintenance and other uh, operational parameters and after conducting a thorough uh, audit ICAO came out to this conclusion that even SpiceJet's airworthiness is good and the practices at SpiceJet are better. And later on, we saw that SpiceJet came out with a statement and it clearly said that the airline's airworthiness is good and as per the audit conducted by ICAO, it is a very safe airline uh, to fly in. So all in all, if we see, uh, India's overall ranking has improved over the past few years and if we compare India's position with other neighbouring countries, especially China, India is much ahead of China in the ICAO's ranking. So all in all, if we see this news is not good only for India, but this is also good for SpiceJet and for other airlines as this gives more confidence to the flyers as well as it gives more confidence to the, to the investors of these airlines. And as per government sources, uh, whenever the next rankings take place, whenever the next audit takes place, uh, the Indian government is very much confident that the new rankings will be much better than the, the 2022 rankings. Danish, many thanks for joining us. The winter session of Parliament is all set to begin. 